Lynn Haven looking to the future as the city continues on the road to recovery. This morning, commissioners, they are approving two contracts that are expected to encourage both growth and transparency. News 13's Faith Graham spoke to city officials to learn more. Two weeks ago, the city of Lynn Haven voted to move forward with a new company for the city's auditing services, awarding the contract to James Moore and company. The residents did not want the business as usual, and I think that that's, that's very, very important for, again, the residents to see that we are listening to them. At Tuesday's commission meeting, the city decided to lock in the contract for five years as opposed to just two years. If we had done it two years, those two years go by really fast and really didn't have enough time to grasp what the city is doing financially. Gaynor says this team will be responsible for ensuring the city acts efficiently and properly. The company will be auditing separately from the FBI. They will allow that forensic audit team to come in first and do some auditing and then they won't be far behind them. On Tuesday, the city also voted to extend their contract with TetraTech through next October. The company responsible for administering Lynn Haven's disaster recovery program. It's been a great partnership for the past almost year and a half. Uh, this will just help keep our projects moving, uh, moving quickly. Extending the contract also means providing the company with additional funding to carry out recovery projects. In Lynn Haven, Faith Graham, News 13, Panhandle Strong.